I can't lie to you. I didn't realize before clicking this that this was 30 minutes of openings. Holy shit, Naruto. What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius, back at it again with another openings video. So as you guys know, my openings videos in the past have done genuinely well, which I appreciate all your support on. And with my first, one of the first, I'd say my first was technically Pokemon, but with one of my first animes I've ever seen being Naruto and me having such a love-hate relationship with Naruto and Naruto Shippuden, I thought it'd only be fitting and poetic to do the all Naruto Shippuden openings. If you guys want any other specific openings, like I've thought about doing all Attack on Titan ones, because I love Attack on Titan and my hero ones, because those are great. I don't want to do Gintama, because I don't want to get spoiled. I eventually want to watch that. Same thing with One Piece. But if you guys have any other openings you want me to react to, I sometimes check the comments down below. Most often don't for spoilers. But if you guys want to DM me on Discord, DM me on Instagram, Twitter, anything like that, I'll, I'll definitely check those out. And I'll definitely put them on the list, because I want to do a lot of openings. It's just a good way to enjoy visuals, a good way to enjoy music. And if you haven't seen the show, sometimes you get a good gist of the show. You know, sometimes you get spoilers, but a lot of them are non-contextual spoilers, so you don't really understand until you know the story. But if you guys don't know, Naruto Shippuden, like I said, Naruto was one of the first animes I've ever seen in my entire life. Quick little story, sorry to take time. I never woke up early on weekends. The weekends were like my cherished holiday. I would sleep in every Saturday I could. But I remember specifically Toonami having a, like a 7 a.m. start from the beginning Naruto marathon for anyone who needs to get caught up and hasn't seen it. And boy, you bitch, I woke my ass up at 6 a.m. and I was watching from the very beginning. I love Naruto oh so very much. With that being said, Shippuden is another story. There, because when I, I was so young when I watched Naruto that I didn't really care about fillers. I didn't even understand the concept of fillers. But when I was, I was maybe 15, 16, 17 when Shippuden was airing live. And I remember reading the manga back at Borders of Shippuden, so I was so excited. It's just the fillers got so out of hand that I definitely stopped watching at a certain point. And I can tell you specifically when I stopped watching. I have not finished the show. I stopped watching, um right after the eternal mongekyo came out with the moon and everyone started having their dreams and it was all just in my i didn't even know if that was filler at the time it just felt so fillery and i was like oh my god get back to madara please so i don't know what happened i know madara turns into kaguya i think is her name and then i know naruto and sasuke fight i have not seen the fight maybe one day i'll react to it maybe i don't know i am re-watching naruto shippuden with rttv right now shouts out y'all but this is gonna be a roller coaster for me like i said love hate relationship with this show love it to death i cry during so many moments of re-watching it with rttv but i've wasted enough of your time like i said let's hop into this please leave a like please don't hate on me i love you guys <laughs> let's hop into this naruto shippuden all the openings So some of these I'm definitely going to remember and some of these I'm not going to remember. This is going to be one I'm going to remember easily. This one is, if I had to rank them, this one's goat tier. This one's fucking, I miss this one so much. I got to prematurely apologize for any embarrassing singing I'm going to do too, guys. I love these songs, but I'm tone deaf. And then when the bars come in right here, oh my god, the bar. Oh, Gara's like... I love Gara, man. His story is fucking awesome. Oh, when you didn't know who the Akatsuki was, man. Come on. I remember pe people seeing Daydar for the first time. What the fuck? Who's that? That's fire. I love that. You are my dream. Oh, Sai Yamato. Yep, this was a crazy time. Met up with Sasuke for the first time. The distance. Ooh, Donzo. First time we ever saw Four Tails. Oh, one of my favorites. You are my friend. Thank you, my friend. 
the imagery. Sasuke and Naruto are both different, like, different styles of cool, but they're both so swaggy, it's fucking crazy. See, so far I'm 3 for 3 in terms of remembering those. I need to catch up on my rewatch of Naruto Shippuden with the normies too. I've been, I've been trying to watch it with them too. It's just the quarantine reactions are kind of hard, you know? Ooh, I love that imagery. With the old pictures of them in the background, with the new, with the colors, with the twisting and yang. I love the new character designs of literally everybody. Asuma is my guy. Those gotta be filler characters, right? I just don't remember them at all. Maybe I'm just... I, I, maybe, maybe. I'm just an idiot. Hey, it's been years. That could be it. No, oh, that is a banger. Maybe I should rank these. That would be too hard, though. That would be way too hard to rank these, like, if I had to. That would be... Oh. See, this one I don't think I remember too much. Yeah, no, this one's not ringing a bell at all. For some reason. One of my favorite Akatsuki duos, I can't lie. Yidan and Kakuzu on one of my favorite fights, I can't lie. Shikamaru and Asuma are one of the GOAT duos against another one of the GOAT duos. I did not realize this was the opening during this time. I guess this is opening four. Man, Naruto Shippuden has so much shit in it. It's such a fantastic show. Yeah, this one's packed full of shit. Sasuke kills Orochimaru, Hidan and Kakuzu. Let's go. I don't remember the song for that one at all. Oh, I remember this one. <laughs> all the the sad character pans of uh of all the characters. So typical Naruto, I love it. Got the happy ones, that's good to see. Neji never looks happy. Ooh, with the Rinnegan, leaves you wondering, huh, who has the Rinnegan? There are so many fantastic villains in Naruto. You gotta think Pain, Orochimaru, Sasuke, Madara, there's so many. Zabuza for being the first one in like 15 episodes is fantastic. So yeah, this one, not like my favorite favorite, but still easy banger for sure. Am I still recording? Yeah. Oh, I thought this was an ending. Are these? I swear I thought this was an ending. I guess no, this makes sense. I just swear I felt like that was an ending. Oh, we're already at Itachi versus Sasuke? Holy shit, these openings go so fast. Oh my god, that looks so sick. If you were just watching this opening for the first time and haven't seen that, you would be like, that is so spoilery. I would turn away instantly. But if you've never seen Naruto, you wouldn't understand what's going on at all. Oh my god, you can't, oh my. This is the most spoilery opening I've ever seen if you know what's going on. This is so sick though, I love this. I love him, bro. I wanna pour one out for my man Jiraiya right now, guys. It's my man. And Itachi, bro, Itachi's really that guy. Oh, this is the aftermath of Jiraiya, huh? That's a book. Training for Sage Mode. Yes, sir. The Hidden Rain, yep. Man, Pain is one of my favorite characters. And I didn't even know until re-watching him, re-watching the show that he was voiced by Yamato's dub voice actor, which like listening to it, I can, I can still hear Yamato in there. Oh, well my boy coming in last second. 1v6. That one was good. That was a banger. All right, what are we dealing with? We're drowning in water, sinking down to the never-ending abyss. 
That water animation is pretty clean. What are those? This entire opening has been singularly focused on this vision. It's crazy. Sakura, his friends, everyone lifting him back up. That's a nice one. Even the color change. See, I don't remember this one at all, but I like this one a lot. It's not cutting between anything else. It's not a spoiler one at all. It's purely artistic. I love the artistic ones. I don't know why my color in the background is still green. I was watching some My Hero something earlier. I'll make it orange for Naruto. All right, there. As orange as I can. Shouts out Naruto. I'm pretty sure with where RTTV TV or myself, because I'm rewatching with them, is at. It's either this one or the next one. We're pretty close to where we're at. Oh, I love I love standing still character pans and shit like that. It definitely is a Kage arc, but like. I love it, man. Naruto is so synonymous for it, too. The song is okay, but the visuals I'm really digging. Oh, Gara crying as he has to attack Sasuke. This is a fantastic arc. Oh! This has to be where we're at, because this is where I'm at right now. Like, Naruto just tamed the Ninetales. So the next one, officially, I'm not going to know anything about. Oh, no, this is the one we're on. So I remember the first like three seconds of this and then we always skip past it of course that is some crazy ass animation holy shit okay B get it my boy it's all going out in our little side adventures our missions I remember the squid this is pretty big they're making it happy go lucky okay I can't wait for this shit to go down See, this would seem like a spoiler, but this does not even come close to happening. This is like fucking Dragon Ball Z. Are you fucking kidding me? So, like, I, I'm completely fine with openings like this. I fuck with this mad. Characters that are nowhere even to be found are just over here dancing. I fuck with this hard. What is... I love this opening. This sounds like uh, Kung Fu Generation. Is that the... Th those are the guys who... You sound like the guys who sing Fighting Dreamer Dreamers. Is that? The, these guys definitely sing another Naruto opening for sure. Ooh, ooh, this is the start of the war. I can't wait to get here. Because I don't remember, because like I said, when I watched Shippuden for the first time it was years ago. I don't remember anything. I remember some very unique, weird ass details, but I am so excited. Everyone's got their war gear on. Shit looks sick. Hey, yeah, this. Hey, yeah, this. That's a get yo. That was sick. I like that. I can do that too, guys. But yeah, I don't remember this one at all. Bro, half of the openings of Naruto are us thinking about Sasuke. Tell me I'm wrong. Ooh, okay, B, Minato. Oh, okay, B versus Minato? How is that a thing at all? Oh, that is a dope-ass shot. I love the, the finale Hokage Summit, whatever that fucking place is called. Oh, reanimated Nagato and Itachi. Oh, my God. Oh, I love Mom and Dad. With the new Eternal Mangekyo. Oh, this is gonna be so crazy. I am so excited to rewatch this. I'm gonna say, I'm just gonna go ahead and be ballsy and say I watch this for the first time. Just because I don't remember what the fuck happens. I remember this opening, at least the song. I know where I remember this from. Looking at this exactly right here, I remember this from RDC World. When they did like anime openings versus something else openings. They did exactly like this. They did a fantastic job looking at this. They're literally just like that. They're like... Cool. This is Madara versus... Oh my god. See, I know that fight, but I, I, can't, I can't wait for it. Madara versus Shinobi Alliance. I cannot wait for that. Maybe I'll even react to that, because I basically don't remember anything about it. All I remember is the gif of his eyes going like... You know what I'm talking about? That, that gif is crazy. Nah, 
Uh, this opening is fire. Oh, that's my poster. You guys can't look at that poster. That's that poster. I don't remember this opening at all. I know exactly what's going on in the background, but I don't remember this at all. This song is wavy. I love the, the darkness in the cave with Itachi and Sasuke and Kabuto, and then just the pure like red sky background everywhere else like this. Like as an artistic choice, that shit looks sick. Tsunade going full out. I love that fight, Sasuke and Itachi. I can't wait to see that. I know I've said that a hundred times, but I can't wait to watch the rest. I have a, I love Naruto. I like those freezes. That freeze. Oh, see, that looks like fucking seventies crime, like mystery right there. That's sick. That's what it feels like with the jazz and everything. It feels like a crime fucking mystery. That that, that was sick. I think everyone knows which opening I'm waiting for. Opening 16, of course. I like the song. Ooh. Naruto and Sasuke, Kashi and Obito. That's sick. Can't wait to see that fight either. I know I've said that so many times, but Kakashi and Obito is going to be sick. Can't wait to see that flashback. Yep. That was an amazing story. I love Hashirama. Oh man, the fact that all four Kage's got re-animated is so sick. Sasuke confronting them. See, I have no, I can't try to remember how that comes. This. Oh, this is it. It's the opening. One of my favorite openings in all of anime history. Just purely because. Like, if you don't know what's going on, it looks amazing. But if you know what's going on in the background, it's so fucking sick. Because you get to see, like, you get to see the grow up, the glow up. Like, Madara, Obito right there, I mean. Madara right here. Sasuke's partial glow up right there. Like, look at this. Look at the fuck, man. That, like, look at this. That looks fucking sick. Madara is so fucking cool. Everyone getting the Nine Tails cloak. The Nine Tails Susano combo. Yeah, Naruto is very much like a young Obito, so that's uh, it's cool that he sees himself. I like these, like, comic book like character intro screens like here like showing characters that's fucking sick oh my god night guy and the eight gates is one of my favorite parts of shippuden ever he's like i declare you the strongest taijutsu user coming from madara that's so fucking sick too i don't remember this at all this is a sick one it's low-key a, a sleeper hit this is a sleeper banger Aren't, isn't Kaguya, isn't their name, like the sages expect, Otsusushi or Atsukusuki, something like that? Because I know in Baruto, there's like fucking 40 of them now. Oh, this is sad. I saw Zabo. This is all Naruto 1. This is just him growing up. Oh, yeah, now Shippuden. Now we're starting. Yep. I don't remember this at all. And now it's Sasuke, what he went through. Tachi, feeling in a shadow, going through the tuning exams, everything, Rochima growing up, killing Itachi, teaming up with Itachi. I like that. Everyone cutting, slowly lifting up. I love some of the, like, how do people come up with this shit? This is so sick. Like that too? Like, it's so clean. The hair is perfectly transitioned, even though they all have different hairstyles, you know? Everyone needs their own crystal light, you know? Symbolistic wise, that crystal could mean so many things, but you'll never know. Oh, see, this is probably where I quit originally because everyone's in their dreams and shit. I think so. Yeah, everyone's falling into that sinking tar. Yep, everyone's under that. This is where I stopped watching. But I still don't remember any of these openings, sadly. I'm telling you, it's been years, guys. I wonder how they defeat her. I'm genuinely interested. 
Okay, is this after the fact? This is another one I, I definitely don't remember at all. And this this might be the last one. So yeah, that would make sense if the last one was showing Kaguya. This would be... Oh, shit, Naruto looks old as fuck there. He has like a... Sh shit, yeah, Naruto looks old as fuck. Oh my god, Shoji looks old as fuck. Ino looks old as fuck. Do they have a, a like a Baruto time skip at the end of Naruto? Kakashi 7th Okage confirmed, or 6th, is it? Because Donzo was never fully appointed. Is that Tamari's fucking child? No, this is old Tenten, old Tamari, right? I was about to say, there's no way they already have kids. But this is fresh for me. I have never seen this. Oh, that animation for the throwback is sick. That purple Chidori looks fucking sick. Naruto's new hair looks sick. All right, well, that was it. Man, we really flew by Naruto. Man, man that, I went through nostalgia, like, at back to back to back to back to then, like, oh, I'm seeing some, some shit that I, I clearly must have seen but don't remember to seeing some completely new shit. So that was a fantastic feeling. But, uh... With that being said, I don't know if I'm ever going to watch Boruto on or off camera. I don't necessarily have an interest. Like, I feel like personally all my attachment and nostalgia does play a huge part in that. But all my emotional attachment, all that is to Naruto and his generation of friends. I just don't know. Will it hold up to the standards I have of Naruto, which I'm looking through rose colored glasses with? I don't think so. And so because of that, will I have such an emotional attachment to them? I don't think so. So that's why I don't really have an it, I don't really need to. But if people are telling me it's good, which I haven't heard anything, I've actually heard the opposite of it's good. So, so I don't, but I don't know if you guys want to give me a fresh opinion. I'd love to hear it. I love these openings, though. I, there's no way I could choose the top five. There's at least 12 of them that are banger goat triple S tiers. So I don't know. This was just, you know, it's just memory lane, to be honest. But Shouts out to Crunchyroll Collection for uploading this, guys. Please go to their video and leave a like. And then if you guys could leave a like over here, I'd appreciate it. Like I said, if you guys want any more openings for me to react to, let me know. This was fantastic, though. This was awesome. Have a great day, you guys. Peace out. This was dope.